it out to be the most hectic vlog ever. I'm literally in my office at my job today, later. I'm leaving work early today. Then I'm going to an H&M event, so I'll leave work, get dressed, and get ready. I just put concealer on a little blush. I'll go home, get ready, and then go to the H&M event tonight. So stay tuned because I'm kind of working um, my nine to five in between of going to these events. This is life, this is real life. So I'm at a parking garage, <laughs> parked my car. I didn't even update you guys. I had work today and then of course I was running late for the event, but Fashion Week starts Friday. Today is Wednesday. Um, so I came home, beat my face. Um, but H&M and Soho, I always show you guys Soho. Sorry, I got pitch black. I always show you guys Soho, um, but they hadn't had an H&M down there in like, it's been years. So it's the opening of the store before it like, I believe officially launches, um, but it's supposed to have like digital, um, like a digital, let me stop here, like a digital um, shopping like fitting room where you can request new sizes. And then they also supposed to have a vintage shop within the H&M. And I'm meeting my friend Ayo there. Um, she's Ayo Bashina on Instagram. I'll put her stuff here. But I'm meeting her there for the event. And who else I see there? Um, Thursday, I don't think I'm doing anything. I think I'm just gonna meet my besties in town. So I'm gonna meet her for dinner. And then Friday, I have a jam-packed day where I'll meet with Ayo again. And whoever, <laughs> whatever friends I find on the way. So let's go to h &M. leaving the H&M event, it was so much fun. Um, so all the girls, oh, 
So all the girls met Karen Bitch Cheek for the first time. So Monroe and Ayo, who you guys saw on. So we'll catch up tomorrow. I think I'm just gonna go to dinner to Restoration Hardware and go to work. <laughs> That's it. Bye. Hey beauties, so it's Friday. Look at this bright light. It's Friday, we totally skipped Thursday because it was just a regular work day for me. It's actually too bright over here. I actually had to work and just do normal things, so I did nothing Fashion Week related um, Thursday. So Wednesday, we went to the H&M uh, opening in Soho, which was amazing, I had so much fun. I met Karen Bridge Chic, Monroe was there. Um, my girl Aya was there. We had like a really fun time. We were like so lit at one point. Um, so today is Friday. Um, especially at the start of New York Fashion Week. This is probably, guys, the only day that I'll probably do stuff. Um, just because I'm actually really tired. <laughs> I'm tired just from like work and just a little, a little burnt out, but like just tired in general. So this is the day where I have stuff planned. Um, I might have something to do Saturday. I'm not sure. But today is like my official kind of like booked up day. Maybe the end of the vlog, we'll see. Um, but I actually got a hotel at dayuse.com um, because I had events today and I just really didn't feel like just because I live outside the city, like in the Bronx, Manhattan's kind of far to kind of go back and forth in between events because I have Alexis Vitar that starts at 11, um, Global Fashion Collective at 2, then another event at 6. So like these weird gaps and like going to the Bronx if you're not from New York is like going 40 minutes out the way. It's just with traffic, doesn't make sense. So I left my car home. I took the Metro North downtown. Um, I met my best friend for dinner yesterday. And now I checked into my hotel. This is the Nomo Hotel in Soho, which is kind of the center where I'm going to be. So I have the room for the day for like 10 to 6, which is perfect, perfect, perfect um, for my events. So I'll get dressed here, change here, and then kind of in between, if I feel like coming back, I can come back to the hotel. The room is bright, as you can see. Um, let's see the views. Can you guys see me? Can't see the views, but the room is like the perfect size. So let me show you the room that I have for the day. But I'm loving all the light. The light is immaculate. Um, but it's, it's actually perfect. Perfect, perfect. Um, so let me show you guys the room. Um, then I have to just pop out to the store really quick um, just to get some toiletries. So I'll walk out and then get dressed for Alex, Alexis, I said Alex Batar, Alexis Batar, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, so I'll get ready for that. And then I'll show you guys the room. I'll head to the store and show you like the front of the normal hotel. Um, I went to brunch here like a few times. It's really pretty good. Um, so I might come back after that for some food and just, you know, resting in between. I'm definitely gonna do this in September too because like, but going back and forth is just not it for me. So let me show you guys the room. I'm gonna head to probably CVS and some toiletries, um, some maybe a coffee Celsius, get ready, um, get dressed and then go to Lexus Guitar. So let me show you guys the room. This is the room walking in. The sink is here. I have a little couch, door for the bathroom, shower, which is really, really nice. Um, you walk in, they have blue carpets, a full length mirror, which you'd be surprised a lot of hotels don't have. So they have a full length mirror. I got my Whitney shirt on. Um, another mirror here, so I have plenty of space to lay out and do my makeup. I'm so excited about this and I'm so glad I did this. And the rate for the day, which is like an eight hour day, was pretty fair. It was like a hundred and a hundred and ten dollars. Um, we have like the bed here, window, TV, then it has a closet space <laughs> um, which is really good too so I'm really excited so I'm gonna pack my bag I bought like a luggage here um, I'll pack my bag and go out but I think this is so perfect I'm actually really really excited about it um, just to have a place in between um, but yeah so let's go to the store come back get dressed and go to Lexus Batar Heading out to Alexis Batar, have this butter yellow turtleneck, um, Urban Outfitters coat, gold shoes, gold clutch. I'll have my Bottega Sunnies in a second, but I'm running late, so let's go. Bye. Our 
actually hand painted and hand sculpted at our Brooklyn uh, factory. Oh wow! So it's really nice. It is lucite, so it kind of has this like iridescent look to it. Mm -hmm. The red is a new color for fall. Okay. Um, which is really nice. It just gives it such a good like pop. Yeah. The red bag is also new. Gotcha. Which I'm obsessed with. No, the bag is awesome. I know. Wow, look at that. Oh, I gotta do this, hold on. Yeah, of course! Don't forget to try anything else, too. I love the bag. in Brooklyn, but the Lucite has such a nice like wave detail to it. I love it because it gives motion to something mm -hmm. that's stationary. Mm -hmm. um, and all of like the gold too paired with it is just such a nice combination because a lot of our gold has this like root texture mm -hmm. detailing or this like molten gold that kind of also right. has that same movement to it, which is so nice. But yeah, this necklace is new for fall. I'm wearing it. It's a great How statement. much is this necklace? Um, I actually don't know the reason. Okay, it's beautiful. Uh, yeah, we don't have prices yet. From okay. Business, so, new. so new, okay. I can look into that. In okay. Um, this is back too. Yeah. yeah, it's so nice. Uh -huh. The scissors are new for fall. Um, we've never done this before. Oh, look, but I'll take it all. <laughs> I know, the handles are amazing. It's like that same clear loose side. Mm -hmm. It's like such a nice yeah. combination. I love that. I feel like I'm a little in between. Like, yeah, I know. I'm the same way. Like, <laughs> like half and half. I know, I'm the same way. But I mean, that's why I love like stuff like this. Yeah, that's that, why I like that, this. Yeah, yeah, that would be like an everyday look for me. Mm -hmm. And then for more of like, you know, a showstopper, yeah. I would go for something like this. But Agreed. it's so beautiful. Like all the stone detailing. This chocolate brown is new mm -hmm. for fall too. And it's just so rich. Love I that. love this bangle too. It like kind of goes into the mouth. So it gives it like one whole look. Mm -hmm. I love that. But these are some of our best sellers. I mean, with your look now, oh, like this yeah. would be like amazing. perfect. <laughs> yeah, this is so good. This is actually a bestseller for yeah. us. And then this is a new version um, of a bestseller that we've had for mm -hmm. a few seasons now. But what I love about our handbags is that he really incorporates like the jewelry artwork element into everything. Like mm -hmm. all of these bags here, you can wear them sort of on your hand. Yeah, I like um, that. So it gives you almost like a two-in-one look, two -in -one. which I love. I love that. I think it's so cute. This is great. It really like elevates the denim too, mm -hmm. with the clear lucite and the metal work. And then all, again, this is all hand painted, hand sculpted. Um, and these little like jewel toned hinge bracelets are so cute. But I love this color. Yeah, I, think I love it's the color like the too. Pop. I love this. This is yeah. really nice. Because a lot of times you see denim, you don't see like an extra like detail on it. I know. Are somewhat new to carrying handbags, but mm -hmm. I feel like we've done such a good job with it, and he really just. No, the details are he, right. Yeah, the yeah. details are incredible. He just elevates, you know, just what would be like a normal evening clutch with so much detail. Mm -hmm. No, I love it. I feel like silver is having such a moment yeah. right now, and he does it so well. Um, this silver bullet bag is going to be new for fall, mm -hmm. so it really accompanies the gold so well. Um, I'm obsessed with this bag, I will be getting it when it comes out, it's so amazing. But yeah, all of this like brute sort of textured metal work. Mm -hmm. um, no, this is gorgeous. It really pops in the silver. And then we have like more of our clear lucite. Yeah. I think these earrings are so Those cool. Are cool. Um, it's got like a silver backing to it, so it has like a little bit of an iridescent sheen, which I right. think is so nice. But these are actually all clip-ons. Oh, which nice. Is cool too. I was gonna ask, like, are they heavy? Yeah, they're actually not. You can feel them, but because the lucite is so light, mm -hmm. it feels like relatively nothing. Oh yeah, it's very very light. Yeah. Yeah, very light. This is so, so amazing. Yes. Right on trend. I know, right on trend. Yeah, yeah. We call this our candy box bag. Uh -huh. It um, is actually inspired by like a lunch box that you carry <laughs> to school. Um, but Alexis took that and definitely really elevated it. It's such a fun like evening party bag. Yeah. I feel like it's great for occasions. It's got the sculpted um, lucite and then also like our fun confetti crystals. Yes. 
And then we have more of that like confetti crystal jewelry here that's all new. I love it. And I'm obsessed. <laughs> I'm yeah. loving everything. I love this deck. I know. I actually just got this. I'm so excited to wear it, but I love anything that's like a stacked mm -hmm. look, look right. and I love that so many of these pieces you can like mix around. This, like, oh my god. Yeah, the snake. Yeah. So cool. It's really cool. I love like the chunkiness. Even this one I like too. Yeah. The statement. Hmm. So I just left Alexis Vitar. Everybody was so sweet. You know how you meet genuinely like, sweet people. I'm so nice inside. The jewelry, guys, bomb. Let me turn down this brightness. The jewelry, bomb, 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 bomb. So many things. I'm sure I showed you all of it. They, I got in the, one of the necklaces that um, I'm excited to actually wear to my vacation on my vacation. So I'm excited about that. So now I'm gonna catch a cab and go to um, Global Fashion Collective. And I'm debating on like, am I hungry? Do I want to wait for after? I'm still we'll see. But the store was beautiful. The stories, gorgeous. Check out Lexus Guitar. So on to the next thing. I'm like standing in the West Village. Like, should I eat? <laughs> What should I do? I'm not sure. It has a little bit of time to kill. So, on to the next thing. It's so funny because I just realized that I did not bring my wallet. Because I packed all my, my camera with extra batteries. No wallet. So, if it doesn't take Apple Pay, I can't eat it anyway. So, I think we're just gonna get to the next event a little bit early. Because maybe I can see who's there and take some pictures. Because I don't have pictures in this outfit. So let's do that and it's like the perfect day in the city where it's not too cold it's not too windy it's sunny um because literally when i tell you it's been raining in new york and like just so cold <laughs> every day so it's almost like god knew we needed to be outside so it's like perfect perfect weather so let me get an uber and go to the next event because i don't have a wallet <laughs> It is fashion week and we're surviving. We're not dead. No. We may need like a Red Bull or something, but the like- The may die. I, I could, I could, you know, you know? And then, and then I get to sleep, so. Yes. <laughs> I might even take a little power nap before my Revive fashion event at 6. Let's see. Back in the elevator. Um, so I can get 
charged before my next event, like charged up literally like energy. Um, and then I want to change as well, you know, so get some hydration, take a nap, eat. I actually might order room service um, before the next event. So that's what we're gonna do, order room service before I change to go to my next thing. So I'm retouching my makeup. Like I wait, I didn't even end up napping at all. <laughs> like at all, I didn't end up napping. I was like, okay, this was just laying down for like 10 minutes and just eating um, the digging that I got. So I'm just gonna touch up my makeup. Um, this event um, is a smaller event. Um, it's called Revive. Um, where they're showing a small independent brand. I forget the, I don't forget the name, but I can't pronounce it and I'm not gonna screw it up. But it's a smaller brand that they're showcasing tonight. Um, <clears throat> that I wanna show my support to. I was thinking about like changing my out, well I am gonna change, but the skirt I have is the Wake Mold skirt that I showed you guys um, like a few, like a month or two back. I'm not gonna change my makeup much. I changed my foundation and I will have to say I've been liking it. I've been doing the Estee Lauder Double Wear. This, like my makeup is like in place. So I want to touch up my eyes a little bit um, and do like a little bit of black liner underneath the eyes. Um, little liner. But I've been loving that foundation. I used to use I said a lot of double wear back in the day and I just put it down and I you know I gravitate towards something else, but sometimes the oldies are the goodies. Um but I've been liking it. My face has been like like beat and I've been feeling it. Um I'm loving this makeup by Mario palette as well. Probably just take a little bit of dark brown in the crease. It's their his matte palette. And I love how compact it is. Um, it's really compact, which I like. I'm just taking some, messing with some browns and just putting it in my crease a little bit. But the pigment is like really, really nice on them. And I didn't want to do my makeup over without completely like taking off my lashes. So we've got a little bit of definition there. Um, I'll take this tan color here and put it on my lid. Like I just want to do something on my lid without having to redo my makeup again, but still have something a little bit different. So let's go over the lid. Um, Fashion Week, like in New York, like I feel like, I know I don't have many things, which I'm not complaining about, but I feel like it's a lot more quiet than like in September, like everybody's here, everybody's out. Everybody's here, um, where it's a little bit different. It's like a little darker shade to go on the outside corner. I'm like smoking it out a little bit. Uh, yeah. So we smoke that out. See, just a little, a little something, something. Yeah. And I also picked this up. I know we're not really talking about makeup, but this easy, Bacon Snatch Huda. So I'll set my under eyes with the Fenty like I normally do, banana. Then I take a brush and just go underneath my eyes a little bit and I've been liking that too. So the makeup is pretty much touched up. I just wanted to do my eyes really quick. Let me smoke out my bottom lash line. I don't think I bought that brush. Okay, I will not be smoking out my lash line because I don't have that bowl, that brush. Let me, um, go in with my powder puff like in the areas of a little oily like here and yeah let me go in with my blush brush um can't find my blush brush now why is it so easy to get disorganized my blush brush. Well, oh, here it is. I'm going in. I used this blush and I actually really liked it. Um, the brand sent it to me. It's the Jones Road blush. I'm in the color Berry. And it's like this one here. And that's the wrong brush. This brush. I 
I feel like it's disappeared a little bit here. So just take a little bit here. I love that. Pack up this makeup. And then you guys know I'm gonna do my Limitless Brown Liner. It's brown it is. Liner is like. All right, that's a little update. I'll throw something on the lips. Let's get out of here, I'm running behind. Outfit of the night for your fashion week. I'm wearing this awake mold maxi skirt. This like fur, full fur, like cover up with a turtleneck. Jewelry's free people and Vivian Westwood mixed together. I'm gonna grab my coat and that's my outfit. Bye. <laughs> so I missed the show. You're holding my light wrong. <laughs> My boyfriend's holding the light so I can talk to you guys. So I missed the show and then I was trying to go to the YSL Beauty, like they had like this pop up and the line was around the corner and then it just it just didn't work out for me for the rest of the evening. So now we're just gonna go to Omar's kitchen, kitchen so I can get some food. Um, I'm so dehydrated so we're gonna do that and just wrap up the vlog for the day. I'm not sure what's on the agenda for tomorrow. Um, only because this New York Fashion Week, um, I don't have much plan. I was just kind of going with the flow and just having fun. So I'll show you guys the food in Omar's kitchen and we might pick up tomorrow, we may not. We'll see where the day takes us. Bye. <laughs> guys I am back um, from the gym so today is Sunday um, no update for Saturday because honestly guys Saturday when I tell you I just did nothing but rested I did nothing but rest like I was actually exhausted because I just had a, again I had a normal work week um, and I did all those things on Friday and I was I was beat down beat 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 so I slept until like 9 a.m woke up took a nap like 12 and then i had to go to the apple store in this video that you should be seeing my normal sunday something's wrong with my computer so now it's at the apple store so i figured i'll make this a new york fashion weekly vlog so again today's sunday you probably would have saw me working out i usually don't work out on the weekends but because i miss other days um you know hanging out <laughs> i went today i went food shopping to prepare for the week and today um what are we gonna do so today we are going to get dressed and go to the folklore presentations um down in soho i'm gonna meet my girl glow today so i want to do my food shopping for the week and prepare for the work week um with groceries eat some breakfast i probably need to actually get a cheat sheet right now um because i was just out for so long um so my body can recover but Yes, so that was today. So today we're kind of relaxing, going to an event, and I'll probably just hang out and just watch the Super Bowl at my boyfriend's house, something like that. Um, so yeah, that's a realistic, it's a New York Fashion Week realistic week in the life with me. So I appreciate you guys for tuning in. So I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna put the groceries away, make some breakfast. Um, it's probably brunch now, make my own brunch. Um, egg whites, and I wanted to try these potatoes. I picked up these potatoes <laughs> um, from Alexia. They're Thai inspired basil chili. So I'll eat this with like, egg whites and some like, um, I bought some Canadian bacon because it has good protein. So I want to try this. But anyways, we'll get dressed, we'll go. I'm not sure what I'm wearing. Um, so we'll see. And we'll spend the day together. Um, I wanted to fix my hair because it's a little frizzy. I haven't been putting a lot of products. So I wanted to try a new, product that I got from Miel Organics. I think that's in this bag too. I wanted to try this out. I used to use, I usually use like a foam from Shea Moisture, but I wanted to try this. So this is the Miel Rice Water Braid Set Foam. I've been trying not to put a lot of product in my hair because at one point, like last time I had these braids and I was putting so much foam, it got like, it made like the human hair that I leave out, it just made it so like, 
I don't know how to explain like tacky so I just been putting water but now I'll put a little bit of water and I'll put this to reset it and you know grease my scalp so we'll do that um, and I'll see you guys later when I'm, I'm dressed and we are ready to go guys don't please don't judge me <laughs> but I'm wearing my awake mole skirt again but in a different way I'm not sure if you guys can see my room is a mess I'm getting ready in a rush but awake mole skirt turtleneck manure puffer silver shoes I'll wear my silver glasses and that'll be the look for today all right I gotta go I'm running late of course bye bye so I ran out the house like a freaking crazy person <laughs> oh, like I was running so behind um but this is my makeup I feel like it came out really good. Skin is skinning. Um, I'm meeting Gloria down here now. Um, I got so lucky and found a parking. I'm so proud of myself. I got in this tight parking. If you're a New Yorker, you understand. Like, I'm so impressed with myself. So I'm about to change my shoes um, and just get ready to be outside. Um, I bought a change of shoes, too, because I know my feet are going to hurt. Um, because I'm wearing the silver metallic shoes and those they're not as comfy so we're going to the folklore presentation there's like a little backstage event that's happening down the street which I might go to um and I bought my Bottega sneakers just in case because I know these DKY shoes are not the most comfortable um so I'm gonna go do that this girl's taking like some fabulous pictures and I kind of want to do the same so let's do that while I wait for Gloria and change my shoes and let's go to the event I'm excited <laughs> It's just a bit longer, the edges are cut wrong, so right. it's delicate. It's, it's, you know, really pretty shoe, really special. Um, awesome. So that's been fun and it, you know, it's offered in two other colors. This one will be out in the fall. Okay, I love that. And then the pink is already available on site, as well as the zebra that I have on. Mm. Yeah. I love that. Thank you. Um, and our signature is the Love Struck, which is a heart decal shoe. Um, very exclusive to Arch and mm -hmm. we hope to continue to build this as our signature staple. Nice. Um, and so we put it into a boot as well. So this will be out in the fall. Really excited about that. Cool. And, um, and these, are these available now? These are not. These are coming out in the fall. Fall, okay. The, um, Puff Slings, this is the brand new design, debuting it here. Oh, Everybody this is beautiful. Yeah, so this is the first time. Oh, I love it. Everybody's really loved it. So yeah. Even great. all the colors. Like, yeah. this stood out to me because I just love the silver. Mm -hmm. um, but it's really pretty, too. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. Hi. Look who I ran into. Hi, While I was waiting for my friend <laughs> that never came. I was like, oh, that she's coming. Came. She never came. Look how fabulous she looks. <laughs> The fabulous girls. My friends coming. My, my friends coming. They're looking yeah, like okay, yeah. girl. I love I love Amazon. You Amazon. <laughs> it's what. <laughs> Take Amazon. Like they're Amazon they're fashion. Different. You can get them nowhere else but there. <laughs> oh my god. Divine family. Yes. So we create dresses and empower women mm -hmm. and feel elegant and okay. sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, I love this too. So most of our dresses have pockets. We do a lot of colors. We do color blocking. Yes. The print. So this is one of our like. Yeah, I love this print. This has like an inner slip as well. Does it have an inner slip or is it sheer? It's not here. Oh, okay. In a slip, okay. Yeah, so like AP neck and, mm -hmm. and it's adjustable. So okay. I'm like it's true and better cleavage. Yes, yes. Yeah, and you can also wear it. So I just wear a sheer, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we have um dresses. Okay. Um, 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 Okay. 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 
fabric. Mm -hmm. It has two layers. Love that. This is supporting fabric. It's actually the same fabric. So, like, what, what you have on, is that that dress behind you? Yes. Okay. So, it has, like, rope ties at the back. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's very cute. Yeah. And then it has, like, net mm -hmm. in it to give it more. Okay. Oh, so make it like full? Yeah. Okay. I love that. Is this gold plated? Yeah. Okay. Gold plated brass and uh, the silver ones as sterling silver. Okay. No, I love that. Because usually, like, um, if I try it ear cup, it doesn't stay on my ear. Ah, I see. This yeah. one is kind of a little bit different. It's an ear climber, so it requires some piercings. Oh, it does? So it won't fall out. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so you put it at the base and then it goes up right. the ear. That's pretty. So that was the event, the folklore presentation, where I got to meet a lot of independent designers, a lot of black designers. Um, some were based out of here, out of New York City. Um, Nigeria, Lagos, make sure I know where I'm going. Um, but I had a really great time, saw a lot of the girls. Um, I hope you guys can hear, because I'm not sure if it'll get flagged, like a lot of the brands like just talking about how um, the pieces that they came about, the pieces that they um, are known for. So hopefully you guys are able to see some of that. Now, like I said and predicted, my feet are barking. We're gonna end the vlog today, well for today. I think we should be picking up Monday afternoon. I have a YouTube event, my first YouTube event, um, where we're gonna go watch the Super Bowl and watch Asha. So, hope you guys enjoyed the day. I'll see you guys tomorrow, bye.